All right, we are live here, and I will just uh, quickly advertise the stream in several discords. Yeah, so Dango, you can take a moment here to just take a look at the boxes and make any comments about what you think will happen here in this game. Okay. Uh, I didn't see the stream yet. Alright, good night afternoon everyone. I think we're already here. Hi so, everyone. Yeah, today we're joined by Sweet Dango. Uh, yeah. hey. Dango, do you want to make any comments here? Uh any comments on, on what? <laughs> I don't know. Like what do you expect from these players from this match? Uh let me check. Oh oh oh. Let me join the stream first. All right. I was I was still in the advertisement. <laughs> okay, should be now. Okay, okay. This guy. Okay. Hang on, I just uh, started the uh, stream in Discord, so you can oh, see okay. that now. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was okay, wondering so... uh, what you're missing there. Yeah. Okay. So, um, oh, these two blocks are pretty meta from both sides actually right yeah i think so. so so we have all the new units here Ares. yeah and uh, all of them have four healers right yep i didn't see so the first player got here the second player got luna uh the first player got leonhard the second player got claret uh, that's pretty much the only difference, right? If I'm, am I missing something? That's the only difference between player one and player two. Yeah, right? both of them seem to be playing some sort of ban the juggler. I mean, ban the landius, kill the juggler team. Yeah, I feel like so because both players oh. are more focused on the single target strategy for sure. Uh, okay. Especially the player two. I think he's full, he's like all in on killing juggler basically. Yep. Player two. Whereas mm. player one may may have want to kill the other thing as well with the assassins. So his his objective is either to kill the juggler or kill the other thing. Yeah, seems like both of them are going to ban Landius and pick up juggler as expected. Yeah, I mean if you have He -He in the box, that means you have to be to ban Landius. Without banning Landius he -he is like, he -he is like, uh, very hard to to kill the enemy before killing himself. <laughs> yep. So it looks like yeah. they're both starting off with third uh, D lit bands plus a double healer band afterwards. Yeah. yeah, I mean it makes sense. D lit uh, with juggler and trying to kill juggler team was the second band. Second player plays the Aris here. Aris, mm -hmm. if he can dispel the water, is like a hundred percent kill on the juggler. So, um, and uh, there is uh, Liana in second player here. Yeah, that Liana mm. act again could be very good here. Yeah. I definitely like the second player team a lot more now. Yeah, having this Luna against both Bozo and Mr. Knight could be good. And now also having yeah. Bozo. So, very yeah. high magic defense here. Yeah. And also, yeah, let's check if the Hihei can kill. The he he if he can kill or not would be the key. Uh but he's yep. not moving up his he he turn one. Uh yep. the juggler does not have the magical guard. Let's check if they have. Oh we cannot yeah, check. No, no no magical guard as he expected. So he needs yep. to be careful because 
with uh, Liana's again. Oh, there's no miss out, miss out night for player two. So that's fine. Yeah, so that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, this Mr. Knight going full single target. Yeah, this is like Zelda's uh, setup. Zelda always use that as well, Mystery Knight. Because the goal is very clear is to kill the juggler, right? But uh, uh, I didn't see how the juggler is getting killed, to be honest, uh, for player two. Because there is God's Pale on juggler, so he cannot kill that easily. And uh, there is also Luna uh, around juggler, so Knight of Mystery cannot kill as well. So yeah, it, it looks hard to me to get through the juggler from player one. So yeah, I'm, I'm favoring player two a lot in this game. Yeah, if uh, this gospel, player, yeah, if the gospel yeah. does go on juggler, uh, he can't really apply the hero reversal anymore. Yeah, yeah. And then, mystery knight can't exactly one shot. And this mystery knight is bringing two single target. Yeah. yeah, I mean, yeah, it's not like AOE is doing much here, so maybe that's fun. Okay. Yeah, it's just with Luna around, it's like zero chance your net on mystery is going to kill. Uh, the ghost field has to go with the juggler though, right? Yeah. I didn't see how it, it is not going for juggler. Because you are worrying about the random debuff from net on mystery as well. Okay, Luna is calling the faction path for Liana. Hmm. Luna is also kind of just faction buffing for herself as well. Oh, the Aries already started. Yeah, this is a kill because the juggler is not going to be in water. Yep, yeah, this is a kill. Attack these two units. This is a kill. Yeah, the the juggler is already dead. Yeah, the juggler is already dead. You can bypass one Hihe here as well. All right, is this so uh, that six is... stars? Yeah, it's a. It should be six star, right? Otherwise, you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's a six star. That's a six star. All right, so yeah. this so, much attack. So eight percent. So eight percent uh, increase in crit chance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a dead juggler. That's a dead juggler, and it, it it cannot survive that. Yeah, the troops are all max too. Yeah. So oh yeah, about eleven hundred in it's water. Dead. It should still be dead. It should still be dead. It, it dispels three buff, so it is easy to dispel the defense buff. There's the thorns as uh, well. Which it didn't. All right. It is a kill. Both are dead. Yeah, it is a kill. What? How is Aris dead? Is that a throne? Yeah, that was thorns. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, that was oh, a. Oh, I, uh... I hate thorns so much, you know. I hate thorns so much. Yeah. So if you have a dog about this much power and it's not in water, it's just dead. Even with max troop training. You know, you know, with max training, even you have a thousand and a hundred and fifty defense, it is also dead. It's just not possible to survive easily. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but that was a crit though, so maybe non-crits no. cannot kill. So, so if you check my uh, guide on Iris, the chance for the Iris to crit is actually very high. Mm -hmm. He has like a lot of crit chance. I see. Uh, so for, for each of the unit within 3 room, which you have 5 units there, that is uh that is a twenty percent increase in crit chance, yeah. So, and uh, if you are using like any accessory with crit there, yeah, it, it's really a lot of crit. So for Iris to crit is not that hard. All right. So the dog jumps in. It does have yeah. gospel, so the dog is quite safe here. Yeah. To be to be honest, uh, the game is over right now. Like, it's not much like uh, this player two can do. Yeah, player yeah. one can't even tactical retreat out any of these units, so the dog can just bite one of these two units. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, this Night of Mystery is not going to kill. Damage is actually really good though. Yeah, because the Luna is not around and you don't have a faction buff. Mm -hmm. You don't have the uh, magic damage buff. Okay, so just a heal up the juggler, very safe. Right, I missed so the whole see. missing the 30% magic defense thing. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and also Luna is not around. So I think player one is a little bit rushed. Shouldn't you use the Wailer 3 cost skill first? Or is the yeah. Bazo is going to attack you? Is the Bazo with a boot or something? Very good damage from Bazo. 
Yeah, I mean, Natal Mystery, people don't stack magic defense on her. So this is yeah. a uh, Bracer boss. This is not a boot. Yeah, why why would you not use this three cost scale first there? Like, right? If you use three cost scale there, maybe the Hehe can find a kill. So this is going to be a beast of shock and that kills the. That was a regular the... attack actually. Oh, that's a regular attack. So Luna yeah. can do the finishing attack here. Why would he didn't use the beast of shock though? I, I would just use the beast of shock here too. It's okay, just save to... it. I mean, yeah, but uh, but then you have to attack again with Luna, wasting a wasting a full health point. I think it's fine. So you're still yeah. here, uh, like up units. Now it's three versus four. No tank yeah, on the left okay. side. It's, okay. it's it's not a big deal there. It's not big deal. The he is gonna to stun himself soon, also. Yeah, after this next attack, he is stunned. Uh, yeah, that's really over. Actually survives the attack. Yeah, that's pretty surprising, actually. But I don't know what the Wailer is saving, though. Like, oh. Okay. Yeah, Wailer didn't do a whole lot this game. Yeah. Oh, this he is just dead. No, like, to this. Nah, yeah, it's, it's going to die in the fog. Yeah, it's over. It's over. <laughs> There's no comeback from that. Yeah, from the pick and ban, you can already see player two had an advantage yep, there. Cause, yeah, because the the method for him to kill the dog is very clear, whereas mm. the method for player one to kill the dog was not very clear. Yep. All right, that's game one. So we have a total of four mm -hmm. games. We will just take a look at all the games from uh, group mm -hmm. H here. So I okay. will black out the stream, and you can look away okay. if you do not want to be spoiled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm actually watching the, the Twitch stream, so it should be fun. <laughs> oh, alright. You can yeah, take this a look is a very now. good method to stream the the reveal, so, yeah, so they can guess who is the winner. Alright, so this time we're going Zelda, to take a look. Zelda, your dog mm -hmm. is also dead uh, to Iris. In that in that situation. Yep, I think I it should hardly, be. I hardly believe any dog can survive. And in this match, oh, okay. we see the uh, this player that we have reviewed a few days ago, where we saw a uh, Brenda and a Kaya play. So that was very cool. Okay. This yeah, time. Brenda and a Kaya. So yeah. Yeah, interesting uh, units on both sides. Yeah. My dog is not dead. And, uh, yeah, my dog is dead to Iris, but your dog is also dead. I checked your dog and I uh, used my calculator, Zelda. Okay, All so right. this battle, I think, uh, player... What do you think? Player 1 should ban think? Landius, but player 2, I'm not sure what they're gonna do here. Maybe also ban Landius? Player 1 should ban Landius. Uh, yeah, probably, yes. Uh, player 2 should... Ban land use as well, right? You have he in the box, that's pretty clear. Uh, yeah, but Brenda can also just one shot the uh, land yes, we have seen that before, so I'm not sure what they're gonna do here. Maybe just ban Well, Ares. to be honest, if you if you do some search on your enemy, right? If you know he's going to use Brenda while you are using the cavalry land use, like, yeah. uh, the Lancer land use seems to be perfect in this case, and uh, you are not afraid of Brenda anymore, right? Yeah, so player two bans out the cavalry landius anyways, despite having a lancer landius as well. What? What? Land why, why is, yeah, okay, okay. Oh, I, I mean, you need to ban landius just a bit, just a, so your he he can be actually useful, right? I to be honest, if I'm, so. yeah, to be honest, if I leave the landius there, I probably just uh, um, ban landius. Otherwise, the he he looks like a, a wasted. Alright, so Why we have they... a first pick Claret by Player One. Why would they do that? Why would yeah. they do that? And they first pick Zerda into the Claret. Yeah, so... that looks a bad pick. Player two <laughs> Zerda is already bad against Claret. That's I'm not sure what yeah, they're doing here. That looks a bad pick. No, but I don't know. So I don't doubt why players uh one ban the So player two still has a chance if he picks the Detroit, you know. 
but he didn't pick the Dita late. So player two just going full meteor here so far, while player one is going full long legs. Unless Mega died. Yeah. Unless, unless Mega died from player two. Like Nine, if you go no two. tank, you have to out range, out range your uh, the other player. The Varish pick is pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, I have to say the Varish is pretty good here. On the water map as well against these long leg at single target attackers. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. Here comes Varish the juggler. That can tank. Wow. Rush. So player one still have a tank. That's a that's a disaster from Pick and Ban. Hmm. I think player one just prepared very well for this match. Knowing yeah. Exactly uh, what player I, two is going to do here. I think so too. If you check my battle with Fi, <laughs> it, it's kind of similar situation. Like. Uh, after pick and ban, you know you know who is the winner already. All right, so against, uh, prepare against the rush player. Two move skills and three C. Yeah. Yep, just a standard juggler. The uh, the sigma is calling faction buff for Clarit uh, and uh, and the Angelina, which is very nice. Yep, and then strong wind snipe. So yeah, very long range. And Aris yeah, and Aris just uh, like after Aris jumps in, uh, the half of the player two team is dead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like like this Aris after he jumps in, half of player two is gonna be dead. Now there are like, two healers, yeah. so it's good and bad. Yeah. If everyone else dies, the healers can't win the match. But well, he can yeah. heal, I guess. Well, so really, so really, the player one Iris trade with the Dithrit, uh, and I mean trade with the Diahat, and then uh, Claret trade with the Zareda, and then game over, right? Yep. Like so, even yeah, using yeah. Alhazard here, so she is very dead if she gets caught. Yeah. I mean, I can even just uh, first hit the Varish, and then second hit your Zareda, right? Oh, like yeah. your Varish now is helping me because I cannot kill you first attack. So I can just uh, first hit your Varish and then second hit your Zareda. Yep, very good game plan there. Yeah. So the Varish I mean, gets is, Yeah, Varish is good against the no tank team, but I don't think he's good against the juggler. Yep. Yeah, the Varish got the sexy uh, Johnson from the uh, from the Imelda. Here's a breeze. Okay, so yeah, there is a breeze from Angelina and, and Aris uh, can just the Iris. Yeah, Iris can already jump in, so the Diahad needs to move out. One, two, three, four. Even yeah. Diahad moved out. The the Anna is dead, right? Yeah. You can reach the Anna here. Okay, so the Anna needs to again the radar. Uh, it's not a bad trade, as I said. Yeah. So this trade is actually okay to use Iris to trade with Diahad. It's fun. It's totally fun. Oh, this is a five stars. The attack is yeah, way but... lower than the one we just saw. Yeah, but the good enough to counter a rush box, right? Yep. You cannot kill, but you cannot kill dog, but you can kill those squashies. Here, hard is died, and then that's a that's a good trade. Like after the trade, there is not much you can do here, and the other two characters are half dead. Yeah. Well, the Iris, Iris is pretty bad here. The AOE damage is really low. So, let's see here. That Ar Ares actually pulled these two into range. So now player yeah. 1 can either attack here with Claret or just strong, strong Wind Snipe. Or can even yeah. just move in here now. Yeah. With a uh, water control. I think the Sigma snap the uh, slap the healer is probably the better play. Use Sigma to snap the the uh, Imelda, probably. Yeah, I would. Oh, second player move the first. Okay. Not sure why. Actually, player one moved oh, first. He, he moved the juggler. Yeah, back. he moved the juggler back. What? I don't. He was worrying it, about yeah. a virus kill the dog. He was worrying virus kill the dog. It seems like it. He moved just to stay out of Arash's range. Okay. I mean, it's not uh, bad, right? Because you, you have more units. Okay, now jumps in with the... Uh, with the Angelina, which is uh, very strong. 
three cost skill that is going to move again and kill this already. It's not actually this is not the this is not a Ragnarok. Yeah, suck. <laughs> yeah, that really sucks. No, not a Ragnarok Zoreda. If you use Ragnarok, that Zoreda is dead, right? Oh, can't say. Since the Zoreda wasn't at full health to begin with. Yeah, the Angelina looks... Is that a 6-star Angelina, actually? Let's check. I didn't check. Was that a 6-star? Because I was, I was pretty surprised that he didn't kill. Because he's, he's, yeah. there is no last rise. This should be 6 stars. Maybe maybe it's a unicorn that you shouldn't use. Like, unicorn attacks too slow. They get killed before touching Zareda. I guess and there she is could have buff here. moved 5 squares uh, with unicorns. Yeah, yeah he could this have. is not on grassland since she's in water. Yeah. Uh, the, the, okay, yeah. Oh, that actually was a Ragnarok. She was just immune what? to it. How, how can Zoreda immune to that? What? Imelda. <laughs> is that Imelda's a... buff. Oh, Imelda, yeah, Imelda, yeah, yeah, Imelda, yeah. Yeah, you see that Ragnarok. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah. That sucks. Is that the, the unicorn got all killed before they even tried to attack? I could have been it. Yeah, I probably use angle better. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Still, you are the Zoreda. You are the Zoreda expert. You should explain that. How can how can this Zoreda s survive the Angelina? Ah, uh, well, she's in hide and seek. That's all I got. Yeah, I mean, you get plenty of the damage reduction, but there is no last threat for you. Alright, so now player like... one is now to. It's, it's like uh, he's uh, he's worried a little bit now. Okay, he's going to kill the Imelda here. Yep. Yeah, he's going to kill the Imelda. That's a, a hundred percent kill. For a thousand percent. Yeah, that's. cannot be deadier. Yep. Okay. Rush yeah. still can reach. Mm hmm. Cannot reach, yeah. Well calculated. And this Zerda should just be dead to the Clarion now. Yeah. So before, yeah. she couldn't reach anyone. Yeah, I mean, player one could have been more patient as well, because uh, as the turns goes by, the Zerda will lose the height buff, and then you jump in, you should definitely kill. And uh, yeah, so the first hit, hit on Virage, second hit on Zoreda is the plan, right? I don't know you have yeah. to kill the first alive though. Do you really have to? Uh, you can just uh, directly kill the Zoreda to secure the win, right? Oh, well, that also works. You strike them and then use first aid. So that's why they brought this. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's very smart. Yeah, that's very smart. Yeah, the battle is already... Oh, yep, this in. is gonna seal that, since both of them cannot move, they should just die in the fog now. Yeah, this is already win. This this is over. Yeah, the second player's pick and ban has a lot of problem here. Yeah, this... This is going to be plenty of damage. 2000. <laughs> That's hard to... Alright, let's see this damage. Yeah, yeah, this is not going to be too high. Yeah. Not going to be enough. Yep, Zerda's attacking here. Dead in the water. Still not good enough. Wow, it's actually pretty close. <laughs> what if the chapter is dead, actually? I don't think that was you... close at all. Yeah, but I mean... Why? Why? I, I still think like if you kill the Zoreda there, didn't you just auto win? Like I, I would still, I would still use the Clara to kill the Zoreda. Like, cause, cause that's just a, uh, a lot safer, right? Yep, for is dead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, we're gonna bring up the next match here. So we're mm -hmm. on game three of four now. Yeah. The by the way, the name of the first player. 
was like a VIP player. His name suggests that he only pays the uh, VIP, so he don't buy any of the other packs. That's what Let's suggested see. by the name. All right. Okay. Very interesting. In this match we have. Yeah, looks like all the players are. Most of the players are going to the single target road. Yep. The first player also goes to the uh, single target road. Yep. A uh, second player have plenty, a little bit of AOE here, but he has a leading in the box. <laughs> so player one's box is quite metal. We've seen this plenty of times already. And over here we have Sophia, Ledin, Yulia. Actually, haven't seen yeah. Yulia in a while. And actually a Gizarov. Prime Jessica, but Gizarov before his 3C. Yeah. Uh, mm. There isn't a Yusuke in the box though. Yeah, there's no Yusuke. Mm. Yeah, I don't like second player's team. Um, yeah, I don't like it. The Yulia, I don't know what Yulia is doing here. Alright, we'll see then. Here we have a juggler yeah. ban. Makes sense. You can just tank push with uh, Yulia. Yeah, I mean, the second player's he here also doesn't make quite sense. Player 1 bans Landius, intending to kill Juggler here. Yeah, the... Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Hihe, what is the Hihe doing here? Yeah, for player 2, not quite sure, but he seems to have a plan, maybe? Yeah, we will see. He at least bans out the units that can kill his dog very easily. Yeah. Yeah, to be honest, uh, uh, if you have box with Iris and uh, uh, Night of Mystery and Claret in a box, your pressure on killing Juggler is much better. So double tank pick from second player here. This could work out. Maybe Letting is tanky enough to survive the Zerda. Yeah. Being a tank, uh, really... what are we expecting like, to survive? Yeah, to be honest, like, uh, I don't know about Lady. Uh, usually, Lading would survive Zareda. I do. You, do you know about uh, if Lading should survive or not? Usually. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure as well. Uh, I mean, against a suicide Zareda. But look not here. The, There's like Liana, the... Weiler, and now forced to pick another healer. Yeah, that's a deadly. That's a dead pick. <laughs> how would you? How would you win a game with pigs? Now, this demon Bozo being a demon is not gonna do a whole lot to this holy leaden. Yeah, right? Like, so... yeah, you still using a demon Bozo, that's surprising. Like, yeah, it's especially... season 4 now already. Yeah, and the second player has like three holy units in the in the lineup. Yep. <laughs> like, if this lady catch the Bozo, he's just a dead, right? Alright, so it's just yeah. leaden, juggler, and three healers. Yeah, so if this lady is catching that Bozo, uh, that Bozo is, is very dead, it's mega dead. Alright. Pretty standard skills here, with Elhazar, Zerida, Slice Stride, and Faction Buff from Bozo. Yeah, check the defense of the lady. I want to see if lady can survive here. I think this is fine. This is like before faction buff. Yeah, it should be should be fine. Yeah, it should be fine. That looks a survive. You got the damage reduction from leading faction buff, right? I don't know what leading um, faction buff give you. Leading should also is have that... a talent that reduces damage taken. Yeah, yeah, like 15%. yeah. Fifteen yeah, percent. Yeah, so should be okay. Yeah, it should be fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be fine. Alright, this shouldn't reach anyone here. This is used mm -hmm. too early, I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure about using it here right now. Uh, could you check the skill on Zareda? Is he using any passive skill to try to snap the juggler? Nope, just light stride. Mm, yeah, this is not killing the juggler. Yeah. Not in water, at least. Yeah, yeah. Less too high defense, yeah. This is actually very high since this one is uh, about 1200 defense in water. Yeah, without effect. Oh, this is actually, with the gospel. Yeah, yeah that, with gospel. still pretty high. Still pretty high. 
So if you have that chakra, maybe you can survive Aris. I don't know. <laughs> to be honest, this still looks pretty much bad to me. Oh, he is trying to snap. Yep. The teleport Who makes sense now. now. Who is he going to snap well, now? Well, these two are kind of free kill. Yeah, but who do you kill here? Hmm. No, he Wailer. kills Wyler here. Yeah. Yeah, it's a kill for sure. Alright, Zerda can run back three, and now what can they do? Uh, leading with again can catch this Zerda. Mm, yeah. Right? Or even Dragler can fix it. Yeah, this leading is gonna catch the Zoreda. Your land use is not going to guard. Or can you still guard? No? Uh, you can pull the Zerda out of guard range. I yeah, think. you can. Okay, D3 is coming. This is not going to be a kill. Yeah, no way that's a kill. No way. Yeah, there's also the uh, Wilder 3C buff there. Yeah, yeah, it's no way a kill. That's a bad decision, to be honest. Hmm. This and looks now really bad uh, positioning. And now they, yeah, and now they deplete his dad, actually. You can jump the dog in here and just lock down everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This lockdown looks deadly. This looks a deadly jump. Oh, actually locking down... Oh, still locking down the tank, but this time actually hitting everyone with the AoE. It's not bad, I guess. I mean, the only characters you really want to knock down is probably the Landius. Alright, Landius is gonna go punching. Hey, bye bye, Zoraida. This is a demon troop without a hide buff. I assume this should be a kill. Yeah. Yep, it's good. Yeah, it should be a kill. Damn, sexy leading, killing people. Yeah, and also this using not doing much. Here. Yeah. This is not doing much because all of them are holy units. Yep. Yeah, I mean if this is a mage puzzle, I would say you have a much better chance to win. This is basically a good jump wins him the game. The first player is not is not uh, is 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 not is not uh, yeah, he's not thinking about what he should do, I think. Yeah, the so... You, the positioning was super bad. It's two, already done. Yeah, just got two free picks there, while player one just got one. Yeah. But here it's like a demon bozo versus a bunch of healers and a bunch of holy units. Yeah, to be honest, if you if you have the mate bozo here, uh, with better positioning, I think you still can win the battle. Yeah. Yeah, you're oh. right. Second pick, leading one again. So, <laughs> leading gets uh, rewinded to use this again, just to kill off the bozo. Yeah. Yeah, leading. Leading is still good if you. Uh, if you don't know how to position, I mean, and I guess with player one with just lost by yeah. mispositioning his Landius, getting locked yeah. down, getting beast shocked by the juggler. Yeah, and uh, the Zoreda is not. Uh, the, I mean, the Zoreda trade was not good there as well, yeah. to be honest. And then letting and also... with Sophia rewind gets two kills yeah. there. Yeah, and the puzzle is not doing anything useful. Yeah, leading is good versus no tank. And uh, this player once landing was basically looks like a, a no tank to his team because <laughs> he just fit his landings to the uh, jump range. So that's very bad. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty bad from player one play. His his box is definitely more meta, so it's it's outplayed by player two. Yeah. Yeah, I think starting from season three, like uh, 
uh, even you are a veil, um, you can still lose the game if you are not like if you are not uh, making the good positions and uh, yeah, some details. Here's the rewinded beast shock. So that game looks very over now. He's yeah. winning by four units to two, and then up so much damage. All right, so we yeah. can just skip the rest of this then. Mm -hmm. Okay. I mean, this juggler is not even a tank. This juggler is full DPS here, with the revenge, yep. <laughs> double beast shock. That's a ton of damage. Sophia still making it work. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to bring up the last game of Group H here. Okay. All right, let's take a look here. Okay, so first the player. Oh damn, they they have so many similar bugs. Yep, so it's far like it's everyone, all. Everyone is using the same bugs. Damn. Ares, it, Mystery it, Knight, Is that the exact same box? No, there there is Imanda versus Vader. That's the only difference, right? Oh uh, no, there is also Carrot in player two. And uh who, who, what what else in player one side? Detlit. Player two doesn't uh yeah, no, they have Detlit. What's what else was the difference? The Bozo. Oh the Bozo. Oh yeah. player two picked the Bozo. Very similar to Zelda's team. Uh, Zelda just have Omega instead of Hihei here, and also Yulia instead of Iris. That's basically a uh, right hand side is Zelda in season four. Yeah, so can... he's yeah he's I... going to yep. ban Landius pretty much. I think both players are going to ban Landius here. I also yeah. kick off Bozo sometimes when facing Juggler just because of the debuffs. Where the AoE yeah. is not going to do that much damage. Yeah, I, I think the second player is much better here. Yeah, that's I, I think Zelda is going to use that box in season four. <laughs> hmm. But maybe he will still use Omega instead of Hihei. I actually kick off Leonhard as well, since Leonhard mm -hmm. is not really that good unless you're player one. So also Leonhard is like uh, you have chance to fuck up to to get fucked up, like it's not a guaranteed kill or not a guaranteed stun, yeah. right? There is RNG factors there. To you play to... safer game, yeah, you don't really need Leonhard. Dispel water RNG. Why why do you think player one uh didn't go for the juggler? He picks the. He let player 2 get the land use instead. Yeah, I'm not quite sure why, since now he's running 2 infantry against Landius. Damn, Zelda said he's going to use Parn. That looks dead. No, I'm really confused, because this is 2 infantry, Imelda. How are you going to get through this Landius? No, yeah, that looks dead peak. Like I, 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 like I think he's confused on his box too, like, right? If you have box like that, you should be killing Juggler. Yeah, if this was against Juggler, I think he can very easily kill the Juggler. Versus Landius though, yeah, that's not happening. Yeah, no, that's not happening. Yeah. But we should see and what he, his plan is. And his dog is like, uh, well, what second player got there? I forget. I, I saw the list tail. This tail is not going to do a whole lot because of the god spell. Uh, you still have Yusuke and Leonhard, so you can player two can kill the juggler with Leonhard, right? Uh, it's a Yusuke buff. That's a lot of single target damage here. Yeah, this is correctly built. You're using yeah. the right troops. You're using the right skills here. This to kill the juggler. You also have the damage from the Valor skill, so that should be a kill. Yeah, pro Unless one is just going for AOE. Game. Yeah. But then the rest of the team is just single target. I mean the so the so the uh, the fact that you want to go AOE against the land use isn't wrong, but you don't have enough AOE here to sustain the damage. Unless player two is being stupid and he just let the land use get jumped by the juggler. It's going to be pretty hard. 
Oh, here's an Imelda clock. Okay, so the Imelda can can punch the juggler the next turn, so they both have extra mobility for like three turns. Yeah, Imelda with clock is pretty interesting build. Maybe I would consider using that. It actually works very well with single target. Like if you get punched by Imelda, those Claret and Aris is going to secure the kill on Juggler. Yeah, if not Clock, what else would you use on Imelda? Uh, I mean, she can still dispel, right? Like, if you are countering some AoEs, then the dispel can be used. And then you can have a regenerate for your tank. Hmm. Well, everyone on player's one side is ready. Can jump in here. Can't exactly yeah. catch anyone though. Yeah, the land use positioning is very careful. Oh. Here we go. So the Leonhard going. To... Whoa! So the Leonhard is going to try the, the lucky. Uh, try if you can dispel the. Uh, the guard skill, but there is no, there is no, um, there is no passive to block the. Wow, the Wailer is just a get killed. How is that possible? Could you check the Wailer health bar? That All looks right. the next Wailer. This is just a one AOE and the, the Wailer is dead. Yeah, that's not happening Indeed. to you, most of players Wailer. Well, it's actually not terrible, right? Yeah. I think this is fine, right? 8800. Yeah, wow. Why don't wow. just have really low health to begin with? Wow, yeah. So the Wailer may. Maybe the better positioning for Wailer is to. No, there's no room to jump out as well. But That's then. Very surprising. This is like Imelda buffed, right? So he's doing a lot more damage here. Oh, it is possible because of Imelda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, tier helmet, uh, air, this AoE thing. And then oh shit! Yeah, stats. <laughs> you know that is really crazy. Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, I, I, I already saw plenty of game in Chinese service this email that like, I think maybe I will 18. Oh, there's this the also... blood sword hunting as well. Yeah, and also this is using the uh, the the thing that do more damage to holy units. Uh, hmm. cause you see the red numbers there suggest the, uh, uh suggest talisman? This is using... Yeah, talisman. Yeah. Okay. Interesting text. Oh, damage is really good. Yeah, it's really good. The Leon Hard is almost dead now. Leon Hard can do anything, so like the juggler jump in just kills it. Yeah. So Leon Hard must to attack the the other Leon Hard right now. Yeah. This is not going to do enough damage. Oh, but then you you leave the spot for the juggler to jump in now. So that's mega died. Yep, whip the juggler because of clock. Yeah. Actually looking really good. Player 1 pulling out amazing amounts of AoE damage out of nowhere. Yeah. Zelda, so you're going to use the Imelda for sure, right? Because that, that was making Omega also stronger. I am resting Omega because of Imelda. I don't think Omega is strong without Imelda's help. But with Imelda, the Omega could be do something to the squashy units. Alright, the, the finger on Juggler could be good. Uh, Imelda's stuff uh, increased the extra attack base besides the regular attack and also increase the damage deal tonight and also increase the uh speed by the mobility by two yeah. you are using parn that's a dead choice good luck with your parn yeah so here before the juggler jump in uh i think this delay could have acted again mm -hmm. because of all this uh, danger zone but since the juggler uh. went in first Mm -hmm. The danger zone got cut off, so yeah. she can no longer act again. Yeah, so maybe jumping in the uh, Detroit was better, right? Yeah, jump in with Detroit first, kill off the uh, this Listel, and then yeah. jump in with Juggler. Yeah, now your Juggler is lost. The second player still got a chance because the Yusuke 
can be very, very strong. This could be a one shot. It, it should be a kill. It should be a kill. Not good wow. Enough. Why, why wouldn't you melee though? Why wouldn't you melee that juggler? Yeah. You just lost some attack if you are not melee the juggler. That shouldn't be a kill. It's good enough. Okay. Damn. Alright, this heals up the lean heart. The juggler is still not dead. Yep. Shouldn't the Leon Heart move one spot? If you move down, then then it died, right? Well, yeah, he can. He could have moved down. Like, it also like means... you have to, cause cause your talent now is blocked, right? Yeah. Your talent is now blocked. And you should have yeah. moved down with Leon Heart there. Attack then here, the is dead. the dog. Yeah. Yeah, it's a mistake there. Maybe the player was too, uh, was too feel like very stressed or something like making this mistake. Here's the heal oh, block. Oh, that's the cross lance. That's very good. This use case is still looking lance. very difficult to deal with, though. Yeah. Alright, this kills the dog. Yeah, I think second player here is making a lot of mistakes. Uh, although he still can win the battle here. Yeah. I think. This Yusuke yeah, the, can clean up everyone. The, the, turn, the turn that the Dietrich didn't jump in really fucked up the player one. Hmm. Yeah, I think this uh, Yusuke can just solo the entire team from player one now. Not good enough to kill the Luna. Yeah, but yeah, player it one just runs away. Yeah. yeah, can't kill the Yusuke. Yeah, that Dietrich is such a is is very, is very yeah, it's very bad. He should have jumped in ready. All right, I think that's all the game we have here today. Do you want to okay. cast more games? Uh, I think I should have time to get another. Uh, another group. Another group? Alright. Want to choose a group here? Uh, yeah, it's fine. Just to do an, a van, the van that you didn't done before. Alright, let's go to this random group G then. Yeah, I mean, in this kind of battle, oh, you I should never... Know. You should never put your guard down. If you put your guard down, you can lose whenever you miss and that Dietrich uh, is a significant misplay. Right. A significant misplay can lose you the game. Yeah, so I didn't block out uh, who won the match, so you might have caught who won this match, but we'll just play this out anyways. Let's see here, we okay. have Rachel's actually. We haven't seen Rachel's in a while. Yeah, I mean, Rachel is not terrible. Uh, it's, it, yeah, it's not terrible. If you are using the Teddy Ritual. So player two is going to is going to kill the land use, I think. Player oh. one Player one is probably going to kill the juggler. So player one bans the land use, player two bans the juggler. All That's right. what I see in the game. I don't see a mystery knight on either side though, so it's possible neither of them wants to face the uh, juggler. Joshua yeah. probably slightly better against Landius than juggler. Yeah, I think player 2 is is trying to fight Landius more. Mm -hmm. Player 1 still still probably better to fight juggler. All right. Yep. We got that right. Ban the juggler. Mm -hmm. Ban the Landius. Yeah. But it's really, it's really not by a large margin, though. Like, yeah. um, like player one is using a demon puzzle. Oh damn! I just don't know why people are still using demon puzzle. Yep. 
<laughs> At least it's in this case. A... Yeah, in this game is not that terrible because player two didn't have UT. Yeah, there's a holy Liana. That's the only one that's holy. Yeah. Liana holy is not that bad to be honest. Especially if you are trying to use the Bracer Liana. Yeah, you have Demon Boss on Mifuzak, and I think that's not a not the best decision you made. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, so far it's all Legend on left side, and then all you, uh, Origins of Light on the right. You know, Mifuzak, the next time I fight you, I'm going to bring Maya. <laughs> and uh, I will show you the power of Maya. All right, here I think player two have the advantage here, uh, just from Disposal and Luna having very high mm -hmm. magic defense. Mm -hmm. And on the left side, the only one that can kill either of these is like Landius or the Claret. Well, I think player two got confused, right? The time you ban Juggler means you try to do an AOE, uh, you try to do an AOE strategy. Why would you pick a uh, Tiarius when you are trying to do AOE strategy? This like, could be sense trying to, to survive the Claret, right? But, uh, yeah, I mean, I would rather just ban it, though. Mm. I think it can work out. So here we have a Meditation, Scythe and Arcane Blast. Mm -hmm. Standard skills. Yeah, we don't usually see Liana running regular heal anymore. They just go for, like, prayer instead of heal. Yeah, I mean, against two. the AoE, it works better, right? Yep. You also do yeah, have, to be like... honest, uh, I, I like player 1's team more, a lot more, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, compared to player 2's team. But yeah, the Luna is pretty good here as well. Luna can reduce mm -hmm. the damage of Rachel and Dilith. Yeah. It's still going to be a kill on Juggler when Juggler is out of water, though. So we will see. With the attack blessing, this Luna could potentially just one shot the uh, other Landius. Yeah. So we you do have so? the attack blessing here. You think the Luna can one shot the Landius? Uh, maybe. We will see. Okay. Okay. Alright, opening up with Triton. It's also an, uh, a not uh, coming back Luna. This Luna go is go, like, she's not coming back. You wow, can that's exactly a very... uh, move again against Landius anyways, so that's why wow. they can win that, pressure. That game could be over because the Tanero on the juggler. Uh, mm. This is giving Juggler a very easy time to bat the land use. Yep. So can after you land use. fix the land use, then you can kill the rest uh, fairly easily with Luna, I would say. Yep, Miracle used on turn 1. Getting very ready for this. Yeah. You don't have to jump in the next turn, as Hasso have said. You should probably faction bath and then jump in the third turn. Yep. When your Basel can also jump in as well, I guess. Oh, the uh, Claret already jumps in. That's a that's a bad decision. Mm. Uh, player one did use act again on turn one, so I guess he's worried about the, the act again on player two, so that's why he used it early. Yeah, but uh, but but what's the point of this jumping in? Not what's a whole point? lot. Yeah, it's just yeah. a wrapping a three uh call, uh, 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 uh five cold down scale, right? It's yeah. just a vesting. It's four four turns actually. Yeah, four turns because the act again, yes. <laughs> that that looks a mega dash jump in. Alright, juggler gets healed back to full here. Yeah. And then just going in with a sleep here. 
So player two is mm. Bozo recognizing the cleric have already acted again, and then he's also mm -hmm. going to move first at the start yeah, of next turn. Next so Bozo is that's actually very quite good. safe. That's a very good play, yeah. Mm -hmm. It is not like your Detroit can do anything. Mm -hmm. uh, this is full yeah. magic damage. He knows this Bozo is going to survive versus the dealer. Yeah, the the clarity is going to be killed as well. I am surprised. Uh, I am surprised that the Gospel was not casted on the Landius. So Liana is trying to block the Luna. But it is the ritual that is going to be killed, yep. which also makes sense. Yeah, that's more than enough. And now both and Luna and Bozo have the Luna Aura. Now they can. They cannot kill anyone. Yeah, they yeah. can't just die here. Can't die anymore. Yeah. Mm. And uh, the next turn, Juggler is gonna jump in, so they are very safe, actually. They are this very is also safe. a Boots Bozo. Yeah, it's a Boots Bozo. Very interesting. I mean, boost puzzle is not bad. Okay, so Detroit is moving here to prevent the jump of the juggler, which doesn't really help that much. Yeah, it also puts your team into forests for additional defense, yeah. I guess. Yeah. So Liana went for the heal. Luna is going to. Uh, uh, yeah, no, Diana is going to for the AoE heal as well. Yeah, the prayer is actually pretty good here. Something we can learn from the Taiwan server. Yeah. If you don't need the single target heal. Yeah. Now it's looking really good for player 2 here. Yeah. AoEs. Miracle C trying to attack the juggler. Should be a should be a kill actually. Hmm. Wow, why do you say why do you think the player one didn't try to kill the juggler? Yeah. I I cannot understand this decision. So let's look at delete here. So Fully buffed. It's definitely a kill. It's a kill. It's a kill. Actually, missing the attack buff here. Since this is yeah, just but that, miracles. that's still a kill. I mean, you don't have to use a skill to kill there, also. You're on a mm. forest tail this turn still. You don't have the attack skill, but that should still be a kill. Yeah, potentially. Yeah, that, that should be still be a kill. Look at the juggler. You, you, you cannot survive the normal attack here. Yep, Juggler now is still in water, uh, does have the magic defense buff, so... Yeah, I mean, mm. and the, the health point is pretty low. It's, yeah. uh, the Unicorn is enough to kill you, actually. Like, there, there will be 10 hit on the Unicorn on Juggler, and then another 20 hit from Deedlet should be a kill. Attack blessing on Bozo. Yeah, they got damage reduction, but there is only two thousand health point on Juggler. I think player two, um, player two probably should have used the Luna first, uh, then jump in. I don't know. I don't know about attacking with Claret that early here. She, the Claret really needs to remove either Bozo or the uh, Luna here. Yeah. I think you can even just move here, attack the Luna. I think attack Luna is much better actually. If you if you kill the Luna here, you actually probably win the game. I would say. The good thing is though the uh, land use is tanking now, so it's pretty good. But now Clara is Luna. way too far to get guarded. Yeah. Landius can reach and uh, yeah, just can reach to block. The Bozo for, can uh, kill the Clara there. 
Yep, the team Why is the, too Why would the Clarity not killing the Luna? Luna is like the only potential character to kill the uh to kill the landing, right? You should yeah. have you should really try to kill the Luna there. Uh, it is Basil plus Liana. I think that could be a kill. Hmm. No, no, let's, that bottle cannot kill the Clara. This is definitely not a kill now. It is close. Yeah, it is close, but why would you not kill the Clara first? I. Uh, I. <laughs> Yeah, checking this is a little bit struggle, to be honest. Like, there's so many mysteries play. Like, like when the puzzle have four health points, I'm pretty sure that's a kill. But he didn't even try. Well, I think player one moved first here, and they moved out of range. But this is not good for player one anyways, because the, the cleric cannot be healed this far away. Yeah. Be guarded. Yeah. Yeah. The cleric killing the uh, Tiarius is pretty uh, is pretty hard to understand to begin with. Mm -hmm. Alright, well this kills off the claret here, so... Um, yeah, the player 1 had a chance, but he didn't take it. Yeah, no, if you kill the Luna, yeah, can't if kill you, the juggler if you anymore. Player, if your cleric kill the Luna there, doesn't you win already? Like, Right? You win, yeah. you win the game already if you kill the Luna. Now this d -Lid is doing a lot less damage to the juggler. Yeah, because of Luna. Luna there was not... Uh, uh, yeah, it's just... Uh, Luna was not guarding that uh, juggler. You had the best chance to kill the juggler, and you didn't kill. Now you want to kill the juggler in front of Luna. How is that possible? Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's really a, um, plenty of weird play, I would say. Uh, from the peak and ban side, the... Yeah, the player 2... I think both player can win the game, depends on how they play, though. Just... Uh, hey, Dieter is trying to attack Liana, which is not going to be a kill. But he's going to kill the Liana... No, he's not going to kill the Liana, because he's sleep. The Bowser is doing a lot here. Yeah, so this attack from Landis is still not good enough to take out the uh, Luna here. Now yeah, the juggler and, can uh, discard you don't have a chance to kill the Luna now. Yeah, now attacking the juggler just heals up the team. He's over. Player 2 should have it. Alright, the list should go down here. Yeah, it should be down. Yeah, let's get more. Alright, that ends that yeah, game. The player one really missed a lot of chance. Really. Yeah. I mean, at least you should try to kill that juggler there. That's, that's such a... that's a, I mean, the unicorn alone, I think, kills the dog already. Like, I don't know why he didn't even try it. He had to kill the dog there. I think it was good pick and ban from player 2 on that game as well. Just having all the high magic defense against all the magic damage dealers. Yeah, player 1 had to use the Claret well. Mm -hmm. um, not to kill the the, the, the un, to kill the Darius and loss. Yeah. Alright, so in this game we have a, uh, you have a aquatic Angelina. The first player's name is Richard, so huh. they have Richard in the box. Interesting. Yep. We have a Water Angelina in the box. Okay. Well, I was I think this is such a gamble because if Angelina is not in the water map, that Angelina is very limiting if not in a water map. But it's very lucky that he got the water map here. All right. So on player one side, we have the standard box again. Just ban Landius, mm -hmm. player 2 here, with Thulia mm -hmm. and Angelina, so maybe ban Juggler. 
Yeah, but you still have more single target here, right? The yeah, Yulia. The turret, yeah. The Yulia still kills juggler better, right? Because it's uh, like compared to land use. I think Yulia can do pretty well at both. Oh. Yeah. All right, so it's just going to be Landius, Landius band. Yeah, yep, should be Landius from both sides. Yeah. All right, getting rid of assassins. Yeah. So far, the first band is very predictable from the box for the players. I yep. think uh, the single target box dominates the Taiwan server. Do you think that will be the same for global server as well? That could be possible. Once more people have yeah. six star mystery knights, delets. Yeah. And then after and Ares have, comes out. We have a lot of players already doing the single target strategy, like yeah. Zelda. Zelda's box is one of the box that kick out Basel already. I think they can do it very well just because they have all the six star units early on. So yeah. not many are going to have a six star dealer ready now, except the few, you know, whales. So <laughs> Zelda, Auto Run method. Yeah. Everyone else is just running AoE teams, I think. Yeah, there are a couple of AoE players. To be honest, I think AoE is quite fun to play oh, with uh, also. Enough. And Angelina, you, you, have, you have plenty of chance to win against the uh, a single target box if you played if you played more careful yeah like even i think even barker found a win on zelda for the aoe strategy hey we see a magic guard finally we don't normally see this yeah that's that's very smart uh not very smart if your enemy is not using the uh narrow mystery though I think uh, I think sometimes the magic guard is necessary if your if your enemy has the net of mystery because net of mystery just to snap the character so easily without a magical guard. Yeah, but like I think UP if or... you're guarding ma uh, an attack from mystery knight, they can trigger the fine steel hooves tech and do more damage from unicorns, so that yeah, have a higher chance of just killing the juggler that way. You have to test, right? If you yeah. if you are sure your juggler is dead, then you cannot do that. But if if you can, if you are confident you can tank, then you can make sure Natal Mystery don't kill your other units. So there is a magic guard here, but this there isn't a mass resist here. This is just a shield. Yeah. And uh, two gospels. Oh no, just one gospel. So maybe he's confident that uh, the. Literate cannot kill the dog. Maybe from his previous testing. Hmm. Looks pretty good though. Yeah. So this is a uh, what seems to be the apex boots for mobility. Yeah, that's the apex boot. I think for Angelina, uh, in water form, you have to use apex boot. Otherwise, the mobility is so terrible. The Angelina in water form is super tanky though. Zerida, at least Assassin, Zerida, Omega, Hihei cannot kill. You can check the defense there, it's pretty high. And this is even without the faction buff. Also, you have last ride. So, that Angelina probably is just on clock, trying to tank push. Yeah. Trying to freeze people. Yeah, I was thinking about building a fish Angelina, but I don't have enough resource. Mm. Because, uh, I mean, Angelina, usually I put Angelina in backup box. And if you have the water map, then uh, she is definitely going to be very strong. Even a double bridge map, a fish Angelina can be very strong as well. Yeah, since you can trigger the uh, water part of the 3C and attempt yeah. to freeze units. Yeah, and also it gives you the damage reduction from being in the water. Or the increase in defense, I forget. Yeah. Yeah, like Angelina herself got the, uh, got the buff for being the water unit in water. Okay. 
Well, okay, the Steelix her... could attack. That shouldn't be a nope. kill. Yeah, I don't so... think. He... Yeah, you. Yeah, if you attack here, you may again. Just play it safe. You have the Angelina. Yeah. Just push stuff around and freeze oh, them. Oh, jumps in already. Well, this could actually freeze the uh, backline. Yeah, in in the in the. Oh, it didn't happen. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure what That's kind of plate kill. this is. This is this is suiciding, right? Yeah. There's no attack skills here. There's no attack buff. You're there's using also no these Zephanar. troop. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure what they're trying to do here, but it obviously mm -hmm. it didn't work. Yeah, it's, this is suiciding. Maybe he was so mad that he didn't freeze anyone. This is not gonna work either. That's a, that's a bad jump. That's a bad jump. Also, that's a healy Detroit. Yeah. So Detroit kills you easier. And Detroit with a heal already heal everyone back to four health points. So that's. So this water yeah. lost water, I think. Oh yeah, that lost the water. Yeah, this Detroit made a mistake. It shouldn't have used the Miracle Seed. No, it's seed still there. fine here, since you have Iris Teleport, and uh, this is using Holy Pegasus, so that did no damage. It should be dead, though. I think it should be dead. The second attack should still kill it. I don't know, with Holy Pegasus, they do no damage. If you want to check the specific numbers, okay. the Holy Pegasus are doing 66 per hit, while Claret okay. was doing, okay. like, a 700 ish yeah 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 he should he shouldn't have used the holy holy pack yes sir. he's 66 and the others are like a few hundred ish <laughs> yeah. okay no damage. That's a <laughs> yeah don't bring holy yeah. pegasus don't bring holy packs against the juggler it is not helpful decent damage yeah problem solved for player one now that dealt no damage, in, uh, yep, and then just dies on retaliation. That is so bad. That is so, 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 so bad. This kills the juggler. Yeah, player 2, I don't know what the Angelina is doing here. Maybe just uh, gambling the freeze, right? If you freeze the 2, you win the battle, right? Yeah. <laughs> the chance is pretty high. It's higher than... Getting a Detroit in a banner. At least the dog goes down here, but this use case can just go down to the use case in return. Yeah, it should be. And uh, you can still get the you can still get the heal block if not getting killed. Yep, and this should be good. Yeah. Yeah, it actually kills the use key. Yeah, that's over. That's over. So this is also not Ragnarok, so this is not even going to kill the Ritual. This and is Holy Pegasus is doing little damage there. Yeah. Alright, we can stop here. That's not good. <laughs> not good from player 2. Yeah, I think player 2 have something in the mind, but it didn't work well here. It didn't work that well. Alright, we're gonna bring up the third game of this Group G. Yeah, he has something in the in mind, but it didn't work well. All right, we're back. This time we see okay. reinforce. Mm, this yeah, reinforce is three three cost, right? Or after yeah, they have three cost here, and also lambda. Oh, they have three cost. So that's a, a lot of AOE here. I'm thinking he's probably going to ban the dog. Yep. Player one. Player Quite 1 clearly. is going to ban a dog. Yeah, player 2 is going to ban a dog as well. Yep, we have Shafaniel. Or Shafaniel. maybe not, because you have Sakura. Mm, I think Sakura you should ban good. the dog. Yeah, probably ban a dog. Yeah, you're right. I think both players is going to ban a dog. Yeah. Yep, that's how we build teams. Mm-hmm. All right, Ares gets banned along with one of the three healers. 
Yeah, Iris is just a bug unit. He's she's good on both the single target and uh, the uh, yeah. and the AOE. Both going landies into Iris here. What the fuck is that? Both trying to be aggressive. Playing land use skin. Well, Iris is good. Like teleporting a unit forward is almost like an act again. Yeah. Hmm. Now, player two does have Ares. This can do a lot of AOE damage. Leon Hot. Mm -hmm. Leon Hot player one is actually very good. So I think this is good. You can also just disable the passive and get a snipe that way if you want to. Yeah, but player two can always just stay back, right? Turn one and turn two, you cannot use that anymore. Yeah, on this map, it's not as good just because of all these uh, sky tiles. Uh. So he's quite limited here. And also, if you teleport Leonhard, that's going to be killed by Iris. So it's not that easy to jump in with Leonhard. Oh, it's a Claret AoE. Okay. Yep, Claret with Wind Whisper and also Holy Pixis again. Mm -hmm. Maybe not. I mean, I can understand good. that because you are fighting against the land use. Uh, you're yeah. you're worrying about uh, you're getting killed when attacking uh, a throne land use. Yep. So here is going full AOE here. Mhm. Mm More Yeah. AOEs to be here. honest, uh, these two AOE is not working that well. Like, uh, probably what you suggested, like we block the passive, and then try to snipe one character is much better. Like if you snipe the Aris in this game, uh, it could be GG. Like that's going to be a very good trade. Yeah, except the Leonhard doesn't have an attack buff from anyone on the team here, so he's just playing RNG with the spells and stuns, I think. Yeah, I don't like the first player team. Uh, the second player team... Yep, this is going AoE Ares. Yeah, I was wondering if the Ares with the Ares buff can directly kill first players, like, you know, healers. If you can, then it, this could be a very, very good advantage. The Valor is going to call the buff. No, there's no buff from Valor. Yeah, there's no attack buff from Weiler why, here. Why would you not bring attack buff on Valor when you have two healers? That's something I don't understand. Yep, going for AoE healing. Yeah, like, but you have two healers. You can use, you can bring a attack buff easily. Did he bring the recall scale on the Vader? He did. And the there's... recall scale on Vader is pretty good. Oh, not even recall. What yeah. is the three cost scale doing here? Like, you don't even have a single target uh, damage dealer here. Could be trying the to survive scale. against Claret. Yeah, I I don't see how you cannot survive a Claret, to be honest. Yeah, with do you Landis. see these infantry troops on Landia still? Yeah. That's not going to be good. Yeah. Infant, uh, yeah. yeah. Cavalry and Cavalry. Yeah, the, the three cost scale on Valor in this game is pretty bad. Okay, this is going to be a Lamata showcase. The Lamata can potentially just kill the Valor if the Valor is not paying attention. There is first uh, um yeah right. that iris can just uh, kill the being hot i think yeah you can aoe here or aoe back there or you can just a uh, single target kill the okay wow mm. hitting one target and you still can clock so the attack damage, damage yeah, is, down. Is got That's actually spelled. a mispositioning, I think. Why would you teleport the Iris there to get hit? Yeah, like down here could have worked also. But then, yeah. I think he wants to like go over enemy units and then fly back. Okay. Yeah, you can. You can you can hit the Claret now. You cannot hit the Claret now. Going back one spot. Huh. Moving back one spot. Oh, 
Well, that almost goes. But almost is not good enough. <laughs> yeah, that 20% damage did. taken down really saved this yeah. lambda. This lambda, yeah. But almost is not good enough. Sadly. Attack, really good. Yeah. Hmm, that Leon hard move is fashionable though. Yeah, this. I don't think it kills Ares. Yeah, it doesn't kill Ares. There's no attack buff yeah. on this Leonhard. That's not good. Yeah, that's a questionable move. So Ares just gets the kill there. You no, know, player one's teams is just way too far. Yeah, they, their healers cannot follow up. Like Claret can't even reach anyone here, and yeah, Iris, Iris is way too far. Yeah, well, you can at least uh, mass kill the Beyond Heart, which is not uh, which is not too bad, I guess. That's a breed, uh, Claret. <laughs> Interesting. All right, Breeze Claret. It worked out uh, okay, I guess. So the three cards scale, which do the heal blocks in, yep, deal a bunch of damage to the Iris as well. Heal block. And also getting fixed damage. Is that a fixed damage or bleed? I think bleed uh, is a bleed effect. So it goes through the fixed damage, right? Uh, it just deals two times uh, Sakura's attack. Yeah, so it's not a fixed damage. Yeah. It's like you, you have to receive the damage there. So Leon Hard is getting killed, Iris is going to be killed as well. Yeah. So it goes to Bracer, right? Mm hmm. Yeah, very good. Yeah, Sakura is actually pretty good with the three cost, I guess. Yeah. And that's without even attack buff. Yeah, there's no attack buff. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. And everyone it's that got a... hit just died. Yeah, and also it's just a player one also gets the Sakura such a good positioning. Usually, the three cost skill is not that easy to be casted. Like, it's not a, a land scale. It's a it's a ring. So, Sakura needs to be in an aggressive spot to cast the skill. It happens that player one, unit was like. Perfect within the Sakura range. Oh, Sakura fixed damage doesn't go through immunity? Well, it okay. is considered fixed damage, so it kind of makes sense that the Bracer can block it. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was not super sure about the uh, 3 cost skill fixed damage. I know there are a couple of um, AoE that go through the immunity, like Reinforce goes through immunity. But maybe Sakura's doesn't. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a very, very straightforward single target strategy for player one. Uh, yeah, again, that looks like Zelda's box. You just yep. don't have the ritual and you have Omega instead, and that's Zelda's box. Yep, also and infantry, second, Julia. Yeah, second player actually looks like uh, uh, Bakir's box. <laughs> No, there's Landius. Yeah, so fake a uh, bait Landius with some AoE there. Probably Buffer is going to have Iris the next season, so yeah, that's pretty interesting. But what is Yulia doing here? Bandragor? Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Yeah, I hate that's Yulia okay. in an AoE box like that. It doesn't make sense. No, he actually bans Landius. No, I'm really confused. What is this Estelle gonna do? Yeah, what is this land use ban? What is this land use ban? I don't know. So, picks up Estelle against the juggler instead of Landius. I'm already... That looks, uh, that looks a dead peak. <laughs> yeah, I don't like this at all. Yeah, that looks a dead peak. Now, first player also gets Torreda. Now, the player... 
two characters. Okay, you have the list here, I guess. Now the Neto Mystery and the Buzzle is banned. I would still ban the first players, like second player Juggler. Like, yeah, Juggler could be good. Juggler is still quite good for player two. He goes for Iris to kill the Juggler. Mm, yep. Interesting. But now Luna giving oh, oh. speed buff to both uh, Mystery Knight and Zerda, and also yeah. the Juggler. Yeah, the player advance box looks very solid. Also, you get uh, you get Valor here. That's very good. That's a perfect box for player one. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a perfect box for player two. You kind of rely on the RNG from Iris. It could be a RNG player for player two. What's the troop there? Uh, bandits. Is that a Taiwan server specific bandit? Perhaps. <laughs> yeah, because I didn't see that in a Chinese server actually. I just like Player One's uh, team very much here since you have a yeah, attack buff on Mystery Knight, the speed buff for hard. everyone. Yeah. The Knight of Mystery has the power to kill the dog already. You have both attack buff and uh, Damage buff, right? Actually, trying to go oh, AOE you have your juggler. against Struggler. Yeah. That's a bad decision to do. Well, if the Listel does drop the finger first, it's good. There's no oh, Gospels. Okay. So that's Player 2's game plan here. Yeah, I can see that now. With Teleport and Act again, the Listel can do it. Yeah. What, what's the difference for the Listel? Oops, Juggler moves up. It's decent. So now actually, Liana can already act again now. Yep, act again. Um, teleport forward. And then Ares can follow up. Yeah, can actually jump in here with Ares turn 1. Yeah, uh, the Zoreta is already dead. If you finger that... If you finger that uh, uh, Juggler, as you said. Hmm. But this can be prevented though, like I don't know why player one did that. You you if you don't jump in your juggler like that, it is not that easy for the list tail to jump in first. And second player didn't take the chance. Oh because first the player blocked the blocked the um block the chance. Yep, and then there's the wind god realm, so player two is just playing mm -hmm. very safe here for now. Actually yeah. still goes in with the finger. Yeah, then why do you move the Ares not waiting for a chance? Because now you can still kill the Knight of Mystery. Yes. And also you can if you if you Iris teleport the Ares, you can actually do the AoE on everyone, right? Yeah. Yeah, so... you, you just uh, yeah, you just uh, cannot bypass but you can still do the damage. Now it does or have you can... plus two mobility, so it should be able to uh, engage this turn as well. Yeah, yeah, you should yeah, he should be able to. It should be able to. The juggler needs to jump in, though. Yeah. All right, juggler so goes this in. Is, yeah. So this is going to be much less effective from Eric, because now you cannot punish the. Hmm. He decided to jump in here. Oh, this is still good. Yeah, this is still good. Oops. <laughs> that AOE damage looks mega high. All right, this is a, this dead. looks like a six star Iris. Is there this going is to five be a stars. AOE? But he's not using the he's not using the AOE gear. Yep. If he use the AOE gear, that can potentially kill the uh, Luna as well. But um, no, Luna is not killed. Okay, yeah, it's fine. Killing Willer is fine. Mister Knight could die to the uh, fixed damage yeah. from that axe. Yeah, yeah, and also the axe increases AOE damage a little bit also. For the second AOE here. Mm -hmm. So and now there's yeah. really no follow up actually. You can punch the juggler, I guess, to finish off the rest of the team. Yeah, you can. <laughs> this shouldn't be a kill, right? Yep, not attacking in grasslands. Mm hmm. Ooh. 
could have just would punched. Yeah, just could have just punched a juggler to kill off Luna with heal reversal. Yeah. Actually, Luna dies anyways. Uh, Zoreda, why would why wouldn't Zoreda finish off in this? That looks pretty weird. Mm. That Luna decided to kill herself. So Zelda, how about uh, you think about the Ares now? Do you think Ares is still dead? <laughs> I guess player 2 is still looking fine here. What is this though? Yeah, this is this is playing a risk. Yeah, the still goes down. That's not good. Yeah, this is playing very risky. Maybe maybe you can still kill the Nether Mystery Ooh, there. Okay, yeah. that was just so good that, enough uh, to finish off the rest of the enemy units. Yeah, yeah. But here's Cause the, the I mean, in the end, it is still Ooh. the. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> Wow. Hmm. I think the bad. juggler wins this duel. Yeah, yeah, juggler should be inside. That was a full health Estelle that just died to this uh, beast shock juggler. <laughs> yeah, juggler beast shock is um still pretty high in damage. I right, mean, the juggler so... don't need to do the damage here, right? You can just... Uh... Oh, no. He's still no winning water. on damage by 2,000. Yeah, 20,000. Yeah, that's not going to catch up. And you have another beast... Uh, uh, you have another jump later. Yeah. So that can bring up the damage a little bit. The 3C and, and beast shock should can be up soon. Attack. Yeah, and you can actually attack him this turn, actually. Yeah, Beast of Shock. That's probably not going to kill, but should should do enough damage here. Yep, still up and on a lot melee. of damage. Liana cannot melee here. So that's pretty good. This is not a good attack, though. I think it's I fine you here. you do more damage. Yeah. Uh, the Liana should not be able to kill off this juggler as seen here. There's just no damage dealt, and it's already turn yeah. 11. Yeah, it's over. So, yeah. It's... Just went off jump. stalling. Jump. Nice. Okay, that's a good amount of damage here. Mm -hmm. So, there's no chance. Oh, that is still kill. Damn. <laughs> All right, so yeah, you know, in Chinese server they call it a uh, juggler watching you till the end. Mm. <laughs> yep, can't kill juggler. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, we're done here for tonight. We watched mm -hmm. eight matches in total, going through all of okay. Group H and Group G this time. Okay, so, so. this is the... Uh, what, what round was that? That's the second uh, round. Yeah, second round, top 128 round. to 64, and the next okay. round starts in 9 hours and 25 minutes. Oh, oh, actually very close to the uh, to the SEA uh, server game, right? Very close. Or exactly the same time. Yep, same time. Yeah, same time. <laughs> You're going to play the Southeast Asian server? I will be. So, okay, that's very interesting. Manson is going to play as well, so... Good luck to you and Manson. Yep. All right. Thanks for joining okay. me in for me okay, uh, for, with this casting today. Me here. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Good okay. luck to everyone playing in Apex yeah. tomorrow, and we'll see you guys next time. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Bye.